We are back with one of our favorites, the incredibly talented Stanley Tucci. He won a Golden Globe for his role as Adolf Eichmann in the war film Conspiracy. Then he went on to earn himself an Academy Award nomination for his role in The Lovely Bones. And, of course, playing Nigel in the classic film The Devil Wears Prada. Of course, my favorite, The Imposters. Now, Stanley is adding Treasure Hunter to his resume in the new show La Fortuna. Stanley plays Frank Wilde, an adventurer who travels the world in search for deep sea treasure. My team and I have no idea which galleon that is down there. But if you remember the beginning of Titanic, when they open up the safe and they find nothing but wet paper. I think we just got a little bit luckier. Is this a documentary? Oh, right, exactly. Oh, exactly. Stanley, welcome. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good to see you. Uh, so, nice to see you, too. Well, so here's the deal. So this, this it's, it's basically a true story, but told in two languages. Tell us about this. Yes, it's told in, in, in two languages. It's a Spanish-American co-production, uh, which you don't often... See, and when uh, the, uh, the Spanish people speak to each other, they speak in Spanish, and it's subtitled uh, for for when it, when it's airing in America. When it's airing uh, in Spain, we're subtitled in Spanish because we're speaking oh. English. It's oh, that- incredibly well done by this brilliant uh, filmmaker uh, Alejandro Menabar. How cool is that? I am so intrigued, for the record, by your backdrop. I mean, I'm trying to focus on the questions that I have for you, but I'm like, the paintbrushes and there's this picture on the wall behind you. I'm just, I'm so intrigued. No, I'm I'm in this paint, this, this, my painting studio office. Oh, it's, it's, okay, I'll, I'll stay on task, but I'm, <laughs> I am so intrigued. So you talk about the fact, you know, you were just mentioning that the show is not only, you know, it's start, shot partly in Spanish, and also um, it was shot in Spain. What was it like, the experience there filming overseas? Well, it was great. I mean, I've shot in Europe a, a lot. Uh, I, I, live, I live in London, which is why I'm not sitting there with you right now. <laughs> but it, it, um, it, it was wonderful. I mean, you know, making a movie is almost the same just about anywhere you, you you go, um, but it was it was I think it was especially difficult uh, because it was during the second wave of COVID, mm-hmm. uh, and yet we were allowed to proceed, but under very strict uh, guidelines. So I think it was particularly difficult for the crew because they were wearing masks, mm-hmm. uh, you know, fifteen hours a day, sure, and, yeah. and that's really difficult. Really cool. Stanley, I'm actually also going to go off topic here because I have been waiting for you to come on the show because ever since um, I got your cookbook, we have been doing Tucci Tuesdays in my house, which means on Tuesdays we cook from Tucci's cookbook. <laughs> One of the recipes oh actually has become part of like my holiday meal. But uh, you, you love food. Love you that. have such a passion for food. Clearly you have a passion for art as well. Um, just, just tell us what food means to you just mm. to continue to inspire me to keep cooking. <laughs> <laughs> what food means to me? Is that what you said? Yeah, yeah, I love that. It means everything to me. It's sort of all I can think about. I mean, <laughs> you know, I started doing this this series. CNN came to me and asked me to do this series uh, and a few years ago. So we, and we've been able to, to make it happen, this, this searching for Italy. And it's been a lifelong dream of mine to explore the regional cooking of Italy, you know, in as much detail as possible. So it means everything to me. It's the first thing I think about when I wake up in the morning and the last thing I think about. Me too. I yeah. love that. <laughs> and, and, you know, which is ironic because I know you're, you're in remission for your cancer. You opened up about it last year. Yeah. And, and yeah. one of the things that, you know, the tough part about it was it robbed your ability for a while to eat. So mm. do you have a, a, greater, mm. a greater appreciation for food now and what it means to us? I do. I do. I, you know, when you're forced to go without something that you love, just like you're, if you're forced to go without someone that you love, uh, you appreciate them and or it much more when you're able to have it back, if you're lucky enough to have it back. And I got very lucky. Uh, mm-hmm. I can taste and eat almost every, uh, uh, almost everything now. Uh, in fact, my sense of taste and smell are almost heightened mm-hmm. uh, and more than they were before, oddly enough. And you're in remission now, and everything's great. 
Oh, yeah, no, everything's great. I mean, this particular kind of cancer now, um, they actually have a blood test for it, and I was just tested after I had a scan and got the more than all clear. Oh, that's yeah. great. That's great. Thanks. You are great. such a delight. <laughs> We're out of time, so I can't talk about you playing Clive Davis, but I'm really uh, looking forward to that. Look, at, you can't wait. Yeah, that was fun. So that good. Fun. So Thank good. you, Stanley, for joining us. Really appreciate it. Thank you. Uh, new episodes well, of La Fortuna. Uh, premiere every Thursday on AMC+. Plus. I love that. He makes me want to do more. Yes. I love right? Renaissance. <laughs> you know, folks. Anyway, I love right. those glasses. Right? The whole thing. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.